Hi guys, I hope you're good. Welcome to my YouTube channel, TikTok or Instagram. My name is Mbuyo Salov Lagazi and thank you so much for taking your precious time to join me. Episode 5 and episode 6 of the Real Housewives of the Winelands, okay? First of all, um, I have been so busy that I've not been able to record uh, recaps of both episodes. I've had to be kind to myself and say, you know what? You cannot pour from an empty cup. If you are busy, you are busy. Do what you can and when you can. Um, but also, I've been having this struggle, guys. Please advise me here. How do I become authentic and objective at the same time? Uh, because sometimes I think with the productions, I'm fine. If, especially when I do not know people. I, with this one, it's quite different. I know the ladies. I also know, you know, production. So, and it's so hard for me to... Sometimes I'm like, I want to just be real and be raw. But at times, I do not want to be offending people, you know. And uh, there's been also, by the way, while we are reviewing and recapping, a lot of inaccurate um, media publications about the ladies. And I happen to know the truth. And I'm like, guys, this is not true, though. Like, you know, I, I, this is really not true. Especially, there's been a lot of uh, publications around Anita. Um, you know, I'm not, also, I'm not close with her like that. But I can definitely tell you that some of the things that have been published about her are not true. So I think it's just... I mean, yeah, sometimes it's the, it's the challenge. I'm like, between what you guys see, what you hear, and what is the truth, you know? But we are not there. I think the two uh, last episodes have been amazing. Because each episode we see, I, I think, different dimensions, you know, of each individual. Looking at someone like Dr. Michelle. Dr. Michelle is, <laughs> is changing for me every episode. I always see a new dimension a new aspect. I'm like, i didn't know this side i didn't know this side. i didn't know this side all right uh, episode five was more about the tiktok uh challenge that dr michelle was planning and i think that was amazing i really love to see those ladies having fun and they do have fun trust me and uh the, the i mean episode six was more on the casino royale um poker experience that was organized by anita which was also amazing until the ladies messed messed uh messed it up you can tell that they spend a lot of time um shooting these scenes sometimes they're tired frustrated and drained and i think probably the producers or the directors are like oh my god we cannot leave the scene without having drama because sometimes we're like okay there was no need here for drama i'm just saying <laughs> you know there's just no need here for drama all right um i wanted in this video to focus more about karen I think Karen has been so hard on Mariska. Hard is an understatement. I think Mariska um, does has is not has not done anything honestly that warrants um, Karen to have a problem with her. But I just think Karen loves Mariska, and she sees herself in Mariska, or maybe Mariska is a version that she wanted to and never be when she was young i do not know i'm just thinking out wild i love karen okay but i'm like why is she so hard on mariska mariska has not done anything to her i understand mariska was wrong uh especially for not telling her that you know what i have a commitment and i would not be present on the first day at uh, at, at the kruger national park i think i understand that but she did apologize and let's move on why are we holding on to something that happened you know and someone did apologize and the apology was genuine and i also noted you know those backhanded um compliments from you know karen it's like you are beautiful but um the way you dress you are too loud and again karen said something profound karen said i i love you mariska because I understand the boxes that people put you in, you know. People think you're a typical blonde girl. But at the same time, you cannot say that someone is being... You, you cannot say you understand because you've been put on boxes. Yet you also put that person, you know, into a box and, and be like, okay, it's like you're saying, be big, but don't be too big, you know. Be beautiful, but don't be too beautiful. You don't, you understand what I mean, right? Um, yes, guys. So... That's all I can tell you. Um, that's what I noted. There's some fun activities that I loved. I, I especially when they went to smash those uh, the way those items. I really loved that. I love that um, thing that was organized by Emmy. I think it was just fun. It was fun. I I love the ladies and honestly they are bringing it. I mean every week, every week, 
and the newspapers are not giving them peace like every sunday i always see like headlines 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 oh my god and guys don't believe everything that you see out there i i don't wanna lie to you um what do you think about everything that has unfolded i think karen has been at the center of everything so that's why i don't want to speak about other things i just want to i wanted to speak about karen and mariska because they've been at the center of everything that has transpired um, in this uh, in these two episodes. Next week, I cannot see. Uh, I cannot wait to see what is going to unfold. Do certainly share your thoughts in the comment section below. I love you so much and continue to stay blessed. Salute.